Hey y'all, how's it going? It's your boy Chef Sports Cards, and today I just wanted to come on and talk about some experiences that I've had with whatnot. I've gotten some some boxes and some some packs from different sellers, and also bought singles from uh, different sellers, and just a reaction of of their customer service yeah um i know for a fact that when i order from keen here in the bay area when he goes on whatnot um i know i'm gonna have good service it's gonna be a good show and he ships next day he literally ships next day it's not one of those sellers on whatnot that it's uh, shipping, but doesn't actually go to the post office the next day and ships them out. Uh, there's another seller, I forgot his name. I'll post it up right here somewhere. But uh, he he does the same thing. He he gets, he order your, your item, packs or whatever, and he ships them out the next day. Unfortunately, I had a somewhat I guess it wasn't too bad of an experience, but it kind of left a sour taste in my mouth that I wanted to talk about. I bought a box of uh, of Select, Select Baseball. And in there I got, I got like a gold, I got a gold out of 10, right? N nothing super crazy, not, not a big name, right? Gold out of 10. Got a couple nice RPAs or patch autos, you know. And it seemed to it got delivered, right? On on my whatnot, I checked the tracking and order status. And it said deliver, but when I go into the mailbox, it wasn't delivered. It wasn't in the mailbox. I waited like two or three days, maybe like the Mail carrier, they're usually really good here. I've never really had any issues. Maybe they put it in a different box because it's like a big old box with different apartments and everything. So maybe they put it in, in a different one or maybe it was in her truck, who knows? You know, giving her the benefit of the doubt. I think, I think it got mixed up with something or maybe it went to another neighbor. <coughs> Anyways, the point is, uh i reached out to the to the person who i bought the the box from i'm like hey uh i noticed that my package got delivered um give him the order number you know like is there anything you could do or can you help in any way and their response was okay okay that's it um no like hey let me get back to you Maybe they were busy, who knows? Hey, let me get back to you. Uh, let me see what I could do. You know? Because I know when I sell on whatnot or eBay or wherever, um, I do I do the most to try to figure out where the package is. I go to, I go to my post office where I dropped it off and I talk to the manager or whatever, give them the tracking. They tell me what to do, open a case or, or whatnot. But they were just like, okay. And I like buying from these guys because they got, you know, somewhat affordable boxes. But now I kind of don't want to. Because if I ever do have a problem, just with that, it shows me that, that they aren't going to help the customer, right? They aren't going to help me. They're going to help you with whatever happened to your package. Um... Let me know in the comments below if this has ever happened to you. Uh, let me Tell me your story. Tell me what you've been through. But it kind of leaves a sour taste in your mouth, you know? Because you're spending your good hard-earned cash with these sellers on, on whatnot. And, and, and the response you get is okay. Okay. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. Maybe I'm just thinking too much into it, but... I'm gonna spend my money somewhere. I wanna make sure I get good service and 
customer service and, and somewhat of a quick response and say, hey, we're, give me, give me a, a couple days to figure out what's going on. You know, I don't know. That's just what I would do. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you like these kind of videos, like, comment, and subscribe. I try not to be negative, but, you know, it's kind of left a sour taste in my mouth. Thanks for watching. Chef Sports Cards out.